Hello everyone and welcome to this weekly reading. So this is your weekly reading from Monday the 15th of Feb all the way through till the 21st on Sunday. And this is going to be a reading for everyone and a focused reading for Twin Flames. So thank you for being here and if you are new to the channel, welcome, subscribe, join our family because we're here for you every day. And we go into Pisces readings this week too. So there's an energy shift, change coming in, movement. You know, the weekend we're going to be kind of dying diving deep for the answers, going more within ourselves and finding our way. So because of this, we're going to use two powerful decks of cards for this reading today. The Angels and Gemstone Guardian cards. So we can tap in what, what, with what crystals will help this week, you know, especially because I feel that things need to be set. You know, I feel communication clearing up. Maybe you can't quite find the words to say or the person you're dealing with can't. So crystals are going to open the heart space and create power within the mind. I'm also going to bring in the divine feminine transformation affirmations to see what we need to know. So thank you, angels. What do we need to know, please, for everyone this week? What energy is coming in, please, for the week ahead, Monday to Sunday? Thank you, thank you. And for Twin Flames, wow. Wow, for the Twin Flames, so amazing. What do we need to know, please, for everyone? Wow, thank you. And for Twin Flames, what do we need to know? Thank you, thank you, thank you, amazing. Okay, so look at this for powerful for everyone. I am positivity. So this is the real affirmation they want you to use. And this is real. You know, when you're positive, all the negatives just get stripped away. You know, all the fears, all the worries, all the doubts, all become illusion. And you realize the truth that you are a being of love and light. And that when you radiate your life with positivity, your whole life begins to change. So use the affirmation this week. I am positivity and I am safe. And look at this. I am amazing. I am amazing. Now, you may be struggling to say these words to yourself because it feels like something's trying to be held back. You know, maybe you're dealing with self-worth issues right now and you don't feel like you're amazing and things don't feel positive in your life, but things are shifting and things are changing and the angels want you to know just how amazing you are and that the sun will shine again and I feel you are being protected this week by a rainbow of protection by a rainbow of light power and they're really guiding me to that light behind me there you can see the light just kind of streaming in so you are protected by angels the light is coming back into your life you're being illuminated this week so remember that you are amazing and that you are positivity and that you are strong Wrong. And if you get some blue lace agate here this week, this is going to open you up to power. So this is connected with Archangel Metatron, the angel of divine timing. And the angels are saying to you, do you feel like you've been missing out on opportunities? So if you feel like you've been missing out on something, remember the more positive you are, the better you feel. And that you are amazing, so the right opportunities will come in at the right time. Do you wish to recognise opportunities when they knock? So opportunities are going to be flowing in for you this week when you remain positive and you realise how amazing you are. Have faith that divine timing is at work in your life. Believe that you are always in the right place at the right time with the right people. So everything's going to start falling into place for you this week. You know, you are loved and you are safe. And the angel of divine time in Archangel Metatron is all around you, helping you to believe, helping you to trust, helping you to keep the faith. Favourable opportunities will present themselves in many different ways. Recognise these opportunities and follow through on their promise. You will always be in the right place at the right time when you enjoy the benefit of divine timing. So the angels are reminding you of your power. So if you're struggling with this, you know, if you want things now... If you need to trust in divine timing, then Blue Lace Gate Crystal will help you. It will tap you in with the divine. It will help you to feel safe and to know that you are loved. We've also got here the Jade Crystal, and I love this. So this is the angel of health, wealth, and happiness. How is your health? So really look at your health this week. How do you feel? Okay, what's going on for you financially? So 
you're kind of renewing your life this week by reviewing your life. So how are you feeling in your physical body? How are your finances right now? And it says, take the necessary steps to improve your well-being. Because when you feel positive, when you feel amazing, when you feel strong, all the blessings will flow in. You'll feel healthier, happier. You'll have more money and you'll be ready for what's to come. So eat health promoting foods and incorporate exercise into your daily life. You have good fortune and live a charmed life. So the angels are saying to you, when you focus on positivity and you know that you are amazing, blessings will flow in and you'll feel healthy, prosperous and happy and be grateful for and enjoy all of the gifts that come into your life. All is well, be joyous and life will be good. And use gratitude, gratitude and gratitude. So gratitude this week is the key to moving things forward. And knowing that you are positivity, that you are amazing and that you are safe. And if you need protection, you know, you are protected. And the angel of protection is all around you. So I feel that this is very much connected with Raphael. You know, Archangel Raphael, the healing angel, helping you to feel better physically, to feel stronger emotionally. And Archangel Metatron, helping you to focus on divine time and to trust that you are safe. And now we've got Archangel Michael all around you, protecting you with strength. And Black Tourmaline or Tourmaline will help you to do this. Do you fear betrayal? Do you feel threatened in some way? Are you surrounded by negative or untrustworthy people? So I feel you are flushing toxins from your life this week. You know, letting go of negative behavior, negativity, because you're focusing on positivity. And when you're feeling positive, you don't want to be around these negative vibes. You know, do you fear betrayal? So if you're healing anything, you know, if you've been hurt before, if you feel threatened in some way, if anything's going on that drags you down or causes causes pain, call on the angels to protect you. Focus your intention on deflecting the negativity with positivity. Know that your angels and guides are watching over you and you are safe. And Archangel Michael is saying to you, you are safe, you are sound, you are out of harm's way and all is well. Surround yourself with trustworthy people and know that you are blessed. You are always divinely protected and you are being enveloped in a sphere of goodness and well-being. So this week, know that you are safe. And using the affirmation, I am safe, brings power in. So you may go through something this week that tests you, maybe triggers you because you're focusing on positivity and you're focused on love and you are amazing. So realize that this week, how amazing you are you know, how strong you are, that nobody compares to you and that you are protected and that everything will fall into place. So they're giving me fear. So I feel you're releasing fears this week by focusing on good things, positivity, opportunities flowing in and preparing for change. So powerful. So twin flames, remember that positivity is the key. You know, that you are amazing and your masculine knows that. We've got I am understanding. So for you this week, understanding is the key. You know, trusting in divine timing. Trusting that there is a bigger picture and there is always a plan. Understanding that your divine masculine is healing too and finding their way. So have compassion and understanding for your situation. And be open to receiving love. So beautiful. So a great affirmation to use, you know, I am open to love, my heart is open, I am open to receiving and giving love, and I am playful and I listen to my inner child. So the angels are asking you today to kind of, you know, release things this week. Again, remember it's positivity that counts, letting go of fear, releasing toxins and negativity and illusion, but also lightening the load, having more fun, being more playful. Especially if you've come into contact again over Valentine's Day, you know, or you're starting to connect with each other again. Keep it very light and playful, you know, keep it positive, be understanding. 
and that will put you in the energy of receiving and i love this because you know the angels always kind of repeat the message and we've got i am open to receiving love here and we've got the angel of receiving be willing to receive love the door to your heart is open allowing blessings to flow into your life accept the gifts of love and attention with ease and grace and be grateful for all that is bestowed upon you so you're going to receive blessings this week gifts this week maybe that's messages coming through reunion coming back together the gift of life itself so be open to receiving all the good things flowing to you now and we've got zoe stite with ruby here do you joyously give but are unable to receive so i feel this is something that's been healed within the connection you know as a divine feminine we're constantly giving and when we're in union it's equally balanced you know when i give to george george gives to me and that's what's coming in for you so you're moving into alignment now with your true self so you're starting to realize when you're giving too much so you can give that back to yourself you know you're making a conscious choice this week to balance your energy it's time to receive with grace it's safe to allow others to do more nice things for you and shower you with gifts permit blessings and love to pour into your open receptive heart so i feel you're being given gifts this week you know you're being given blessings and you're learning how to receive we've also got angel light absolutely beautiful and i've got some here so this is going to be a great crystal for you to connect with this week you know angels are all around you and you are safe and if you haven't got any of this just kind of take a screenshot there i'll move this out of the way and then you can kind of focus on that crystal you know maybe meditate stare at it and it will bring power in and it's also going to open you up to love and receptivity angel light and this is the angel of communication wow so archangel gabriel is helping communication to come in this week throat chakra awakening alignment i send and receive messages with ease and grace so this week this is a big sign that messages are coming in so even if you didn't receive anything on valentine's day if you've kept the faith and you've stayed positive you're going to be open to what's to come so you will receive and send messages with ease and grace this week so it's going to flow okay there's not going to be any awkwardness or any feeling of you know kind of giving 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 waiting 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 i feel it's going to flow back and forth between the two of you when you are very open to this when you're very light-hearted and you just enjoy each moment guidance and inspiration will come from the angels and other spirit guides they will come to you moment by moment so you're going to be receiving guidance moment by moment and this is also a message for you to live in the moment and to take your day step by step moment to moment i interpret the messages i receive and apply them to my life with wisdom so the angels are always speaking to you you know things are revving up in your life right now and there's change flowing in so always listen to the guidance you're receiving and interpret the messages that you receive and there's also there a motorbike so if anyone's connected with a divine masculine who's got a motorbike big sign of forward motion i've just heard a siren too so maybe connected with the armed forces or the military maybe connected with you know a police officer or some form of kind of driving around helping people you know ambulance service that kind of thing that's just come through intuitively so always remember to connect with the messages you receive so the angels are communicating with you and i feel that's a big sign as well to look after yourself you know to be good to yourself and focus on health and well-being this week are you receiving intuitive messages yes you are you know the angels are always speaking to you and so is your higher self do you wish to be more intuitive so this is about you connecting with your angels your guides and your psychic side archangel raziel the psychic angel will help you to do this so gabriel's going to open the doors of communication for you but raziel is going to open the gift to your higher self to tap you in with your divine power and the angel light will help you with this too so quiet your mind and accept communication from the angels from the spirit guides and from your twin flame true communication includes listening speaking and observing notice messages from nature and your surroundings so you're going to receive signs through nature 
Remember the signs you see, you may see the bees, you may see the rainbow for protection, you know, all the signs you see, the stag, the white stag, it's all signs of what's to come. And we've also got Amazonite here, the angel of truth and honesty. So I feel your masculine will speak to you with truth and honesty. You know, when they communicate to you, they're going to communicate the truth, how they really feel. And they're going to be very honest with you. Live your truth and honestly communicate what is on your mind with ease. So this is why Archangel Gabriel is all around you, helping you both to speak with ease, you know, to communicate freely with each other, to be authentic effortlessly find the words to express your truth and speak eloquently and lovingly so archangel gabriel will help you to speak with power and strength but also in a loving compassionate and kind way surround yourself with people who are not afraid to honestly express themselves so make sure you surround yourself with people that you know are living in the light you know, and this is why this community is so amazing, because we're all living in the light, we're all in our power, you know, we're all helping each other, so we feel that power flowing in, and Amazonite is going to really tap you in with this kind of primal energy of you, you know, when I'm tapping in with that, this is about you being you, and not caring what anyone else thinks, so this is your primal side coming out, are you holding back something you need to say? So things are being released this week that need to be said. The truth about a certain matter needs to be spoken. So this is a big sign that you two need to speak out. You know, you're going to clear the air, communicate, sort things out. Honesty is important at this time. Have the courage to speak up with grace and loving words have the power to heal or improve the situation. So the more you operate with love, the more love you feel, the quicker and the better things will be. So another big sign here about the communication that's flowing in. And we've got citrine. And citrine is really good for finances and to bring power in. The angel of self-confidence. So if you connect with citrine, and I've got some citrine here. This is my pendulum. I love citrine. I've got citrine in, you know, over there somewhere as well. But citrine is a real good booster for self-confidence, you know, to believe in yourself, to feel strong, to feel courageous. So I feel this another sign here that, you know, the masculines are gaining confidence in the connection. You're feeling more confident about the connection because you can feel things shifting and moving. Are you, are you lacking or looking for confidence? What do you find difficult to accept about yourself? Is that that you are amazing? You know, remember I am open to receiving love and you are amazing. And this is what the angels want you to remember this week, that you are amazing. Acknowledge your magnificence and focus on what you do well to increase your self-esteem. It is safe to be powerful in a loving way. Shine your light to reach your full potential. So keep shining your light. And citrine, you know, it's like the energy of the sun. You know, I just love this because it connects with the energy of the power of the sun. And remember, you are the light. So the angels are saying to you, you are the light. Be courageous and shine your light brightly for all to see. Be confident in your abilities. Honour and respect yourself for who you are and what you can do. And willingly allow others to see your magnificence. So just shine. You know, you are the sun, so shine. So this week, your masculine is going to be blown away by your magnificence. And we've got Chrysophase here. And this is the angel of nurturing. And this is you as a divine feminine. You know, and I feel Archangel Gable all around you this week, opening you up to communication, to be you, you know, to tap in with your authentic power, your divine feminine energy. Do you have a broken heart or are you feeling unloved? So if you're feeling pain in the, in the journey this week, you know, pain through the separation, if you feel like your masculine doesn't care, if you feel your heart is broken, then tuning in with this crystal here, and this is called chrysophrase, will help, okay? But I feel this is also calling on heaven, especially Archangel Azrael, you know, to heal your heart, to give you comfort at this time, and to know that everything happens for a reason and you are safe. Take the time to nurture yourself and know that you are loved by the divine. And I feel that's also by the divine masculine. Open your heart and have more compassion for yourself and others. And take a long bath and drink plenty of water to nourish yourself. So make sure you're looking after you. 
you know, nourishing yourself, getting your energy back, putting fluids back into your body, especially if you've been crying or releasing energy. And I feel this is also your masculine realizing that they deserve your love, that they are magnificent too. You know, they are dealing with self-confidence issues too, and they are feeling heartbroken. So they are feeling the nurturing energy of your love, and it's giving them power. Be You are cared for, loved, and appreciated. And the angels want you to know that, you know, the angels adore you, heaven adores you, but you are loved unconditionally by your twit and you are appreciated by them no matter what the outside circumstances, your heart is open to receiving, allow love to fill you up, your body, your mind and soul and willingly nurture yourself and others who truly need and want your nurturing and that's by being playful and listening to your inner child and your inner child needs your love this week, you know, needs your kind of understanding thank you angels and your divine masculine needs your understanding too and you do you know so be understanding be loving be kind and open your heart to receive knowing that all is well and you are safe so the main message coming through for this week is you know be positivity and use the affirmation i am positivity because you are magnificent you are amazing and you're exactly where you're meant to be have a great week sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.